Hello, and welcome to another SMC technical training video. In this video, we are going to show you how to operate your ITV 1000, 2000, or 3000 series. In the end, we will regulate the pressure and correlation with the input signal. Let's get started. Please refer to our earlier ITV video for general setup. Push the down arrow button for two seconds or more. The LED screen will now flash locked. Pressing the S or middle button will unlock the ITV. Next, let's change the minimum and maximum pressure settings. F1 is the pressure the ITV will regulate to when a zero input signal is given. Press the S key to access F1, which is the minimum pressure setting. Change the value using the up and down arrow buttons. Press S again to set it. This will also take you to F2. F2 is the pressure the ITV will regulate to when a max rated input signal is given. Change the value using the up and down arrow buttons. Press S to set it and this will also return to the local display screen of the current output pressure. Next, let's change the gain of the ITV. Hold the S key for two or more seconds to access the gain function. The screen will flicker between F01 and GL9. Pressing S will allow you to change the gain. This can range from a value of 0 to F in hex, where 0 is the slowest response and F is the quickest response. A default ITV uses a gain setting of 9. Once a gain value is chosen, press S to set it. Next, let's move on to setting the sensitivity. Press the up arrow key to switch to sensitivity. The screen will flicker between F02 and SL0. Press S to set it. The sensitivity ranges from a minus sign to 5, where a minus sign is the sharpest response, while 5 is the dullest response. The default ITV uses a sensitivity setting of 0. Once a sensitivity value is chosen, press the S button to set it. Be aware that a high gain and sharp sensitivity can cause pressure hunting, which is an unwanted and unstable behavior. Press the up arrow key to switch to the zero clear function. The zero clear function is used when there is residual pressure present in the secondary piping of the ITV. This means that the local display has drifted slightly from zero when there is a zero input signal given. Press the S key to access the zero clear. Hold both the down and up arrow keys for approximately two seconds. The zero clear will be executed and the screen will reset to the local display. Next, turn on the supply pressure. Ensure the supply pressure is at least 0.1 MPA or 15 PSI greater than the maximum output pressure value you wish to attain. Vary the input signal to check that the ITV responds accordingly. Make sure to have little to no noise on the input signal. Noise can cause unwanted and unstable behavior of the ITV. To turn off the ITV, it is recommended to do it in the order of removing the input signal, then turning off the supply pressure, and then finally turning off the power. We hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching another SMC technical training video.